for all. Radio for all. You are now live with the Humble Prince on Sahara FM Radio. Yeah. Yeah. And we're back. Live with the Humble Prince on Sahara FM Radio. That was a fantastic callback segment we had. Uh, thank you, everybody, that um, chimed in. You know, this is a very historical uh, election in our country's history, and everybody's passionate about it. But uh, enough of that. <laughs> Moving on to other business, man. Again, tonight's show is brought to you by Vitalin Entertainment Presents Basketball in New York City. Oh. Basketball, yes, Basketball is coming June 27. Check it out. Please go to our Facebook page. Follow me on Twitter. Um, blah, Instagram, Facebook, at Humble Prince Olu for more information. And right now we have a uh, special, special, special guest uh, oh. uh, who's also uh, a good friend of mine. First time I saw this lady was in um, 2000 and I think one or two in Miami. I saw this girl from afar. <laughs> oh, good, yeah. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, no, I was, I was trying to kick, I was trying to kick it to her. Oh lord. Seriously. Oh. Anyway, let's give a round of applause <laughs> to entrepreneur, model, and TV host Eva Bacola Tony. Hello, everybody. Yeah. Fantastic and beautiful, yeah. This lady, uh, we were presenting an awards, um, an award at the Nigerian Entertainment oh, yeah. Awards, yeah. And she was standing taller than me, and I put the picture up on Facebook. She's tall. You see how tall yes. she is. Yeah, yeah. Models. How tall are you? Um, I am a uh, six foot two inches. Tall. Right. So I'm I'm five ten. Be that tall. Yeah. You so, yeah. So, <laughs> and I wear heels too. So. Exactly. So you know what somebody told me? They said, "Oh, she's taller than you." I said, "Well, I count for my inches elsewhere." Thank Hi. you very much. Here we go. The yeah. Shenanigans. That's what oh I told him. So We've figure already that out. started. <laughs> <laughs> it's too early. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I'm early. A, yeah, I'm a tall brother. If, if we go by that, believe oh, that. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, Bookie, thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much for time. having me. Oh, well, I didn't have you yet, but I'm sure oh, we could. Oh, um, my goodness. Bookie, so. you fell for that one, man. You know, <laughs> I, I walked right into yeah, that. Exactly. Cause, I mean, <laughs> come on, man. You've been on the show before. You know what time I have. I think you did the same thing last year. I did. So that's why. So, Bookie, thank you so much. What brings you to town? Um, I'm here for several things. Uh, main thing uh, is I'm here for the car show. Exactly. Uh-oh. So I'm a presenter. So I'm be presenting at the okay. car show at Jacob Javits, uh, the new Malibu. Actually, I think I can say it now because we just debuted it. Okay. So Fantastic. the 2016 Malibu. If you're in town, come by, say hi. Fantastic. And yeah. then also I want to make an announcement on your show. Oh, well, let's save that a little bit. Let's save that a little bit. Da 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 So the car show, man. I want the um the man come and look at you or the car. <laughs> I know I go to the car well, show, God damn it. Yeah, why do you go to the car <laughs> show? <laughs> Tell us. Hey, hey I, I promised my son I'm going to take him this year, so I need to, you know. You're going to take what? <laughs> my son. To go look oh. at the cars, I'm sure. Oh, well. Or <laughs> use him yeah. as like a little scapegoat. Like, go ahead. And girls be like, oh, he's so, so cute. cute. Oh, I play into that, man. What is it? Why do women love guys when they out with their sons? Like, you know. It's just. It's just, just because just because I'm out with my son and playing with him and carrying on my neck and posting pictures on Facebook, oh. that doesn't make me a good dad. It's because you're being extra with it. Yeah. <laughs> Team Extra. <laughs> TeamExtra.com. Oh, I see, man. It just but, looks good. We like yeah, to see I guess, men. Yeah, yeah, I guess that turns women on, huh? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 hey. You're supposed to be guest co-hosting, man. You're supposed yes, to be following yes, my lead. Yes, I'm, Not come oh, and take oh. over the show. Oh, oh my yeah. gosh. <laughs> yeah, uh, Bookie. So, uh, so Bookie, yes. Yeah, tell us a little bit about yourself. I know you're an entrepreneur. So, uh, I'm an entrepreneur. entrepreneur. I'm a spokesmodel. I'm a presenter. I'm a host. You have your own TV show. have my own web series and TV show. Yes. Um, I work with Genevieve Magazine back in Nigeria. Nice. Shout out to them. Um, right. And, yeah, so I'm doing a lot. And then now... Am I ready to like make the yeah, announcement? Yeah, that's what they're saying. Are so you getting married? I'm now, Are you getting engaged? What? Or is no, that that is. <laughs> You did this last time, know, and then you right. had people all like, "Yo, yeah. no, <laughs> um, I, they want to know if you're in a relationship." But go ahead, make the. Is that a, someone really? asked the question? That's a trending Somebody, topic. That's a trending topic right now. It's trending. Yeah. They want to know. Because the last we'll time she the, wasn't in, you know. We'll get to that. We'll Brothers want to know. Maybe. Maybe I don't know. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah drum roll! Huge announcement. Drum roll! Exclusive. So I am pleased to announce that I'm adding. Uh, am I looking right here? Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. I'm pleased yeah, to right. announce that I can add author to my name because I'm coming out with my first book. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get it's called the Purpose Factor. Um, nice. It's about like purpose planning and just really giving people strategies on how to like take action and stay empowered through purposeful living. And uh, it's a really uh, passionate book. I'm passionate about it. Right. Um, and so yeah, it is. I'm just ready. I'm ready to do it. I'm book excited. Yeah. Uh, honestly, yeah. man. Like I so said, I'm ready man. to add it. So yes. It? Where can we get this book at? Uh, so it'll be available. We're look. Uh, we're shooting for spring summer. Okay. So yes. Yeah. So oh. very soon. So in the next couple of months. You'll oh, be able so the to book get is done. 
is pretty much done. Oh, yeah. Wow. Even I don't even think like all my people I think I'll be like, What? She wow. was working on. So yeah, I just man. You know, sometimes you got to move in silence and then let it happen. That's, so, that's the best way, man. Yeah. So really it's gentle giant. Movie. Yeah. <laughs> gentle giant. I like that. Fantastic. So, yeah, it's a, um, it's a really, uh, the book came out of like a really, um, uh, now I don't hate to say dark place, but uh, it's dedicated to my cousin who passed away. So it's oh, just, I'm sorry to hear that. it was just kind of working on that all through like the right. last six months. So it's just, yeah, I'm, I'm excited and. About to make it happen. I'm not going to cry, man. but yeah, that's, it's, it's, it's that's a good fantastic, book. fantastic, man. It's Who good, knew so. that this lady that I saw right there in Miami <laughs> in 2002. <laughs> going back to this old story again? No, I, oh, my God. Because Nigeria it was so it. funny. Yeah, like, yeah. he... Was that, was that, am I lying? <laughs> yeah, he did kind of like... <laughs> yeah, that's a Nigerian reunion. I said, who Miami, is this tall piece like, of chocolate? How old was she at that point? A baby? Com- no. Okay, compared to your a old A baby? Man. This <laughs> old man always <laughs> chasing the right children. Wait, wait, wait. I was, I was a baby. baby. So, wait, 2098. Okay. Uh-huh. I was a baby. Uh-huh. So, wait, wait, 20, 20, uh-huh. 90, I was 24, so 25, uh-huh. No, you weren't. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So, I was about 27. 27. Uh-huh. See, I was a baby. No, but you was over 18, though. Yeah, I was over 18. Oh, just, just over, probably. It don't matter. One year. I'll be, mm. If anything happened, I was going to jail. Oh, cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. cool. But you know, you know what, you know, but you know, what, you know what those Nigerian reunions are for, man. You for got, what? Uh, you know, so let's talk about uh, the book. <laughs> I was about to say, some people have found their spouses there. Really? Yeah. I can't. And some who thought they were going to find a find a spouse out there, lost ended up them. Just yeah. not lost them, but yeah. you know, they just got hit up for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> So, yeah, so I'm super excited about that. Oh, um, yeah. Shout out to my publicist, Yetunde yeah, Tylo oh, yeah, the child of publicist. ICPR. She's right. amazing. She's uh, great. She really also, too, kind of yeah. pushed me to, yeah, like, she's, yeah. She's supposed to be here next Make week. She's got a great book, yes. too. Yes. She has a... Um, she's the uh, bomb. Uh, uh, Chef, African yes. chef. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. 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 She has yes. a book for recipe. So Really nice So all you Nigerian thing. women out there that like to pose and chances, you know, and don't want to cook, we could cook I... our own selves, God damn it. Thanks really? for using the towel. Yeah. <laughs> it might not come out the same and taste the same, but I, hey. What you know do what you saying? make? What's your favorite dish? Uh, okay. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I just love, table. I, I love chicken, man. I, I just eat chicken all the time. Chicken all day, every yeah, day? Yeah. And I, yes, and they t- you know what I like about her book? Her, it's healthy. Yeah. Chicken. What kind of chicken? You No, know? uh, just chicken. You know what my favorite is? What? Don't Egg say. Soup and hey, oh. sister. Yeah. That's why I'm a thick girl, though. I like my carbs. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Yeah, I like yeah, my carbs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like plantain. I love. I'm oh, addicted to plantain. Actually, that's it. Fried, fried, boiled <laughs> with jollof rice. Yeah, Everything. Fantastic. So, um, Bookie, we're looking forward to that piece. So, when so, the yes. book comes out, please come back. Yes, let's launch definitely. it. Let's talk about it. Tell people about um, it and everything. So yeah, and you can also follow me at um, Eva Toby. Mm-hmm. Yes. Dot com or Eva yeah. Toby Instagram to get right. updates about when it's coming out and as we get closer to launch and where I'll be and stuff like that. Fantastic. So yeah. Yeah. You have any questions for? Our- yeah, so what you're been... supposed to be guest co host. Oh, but too. yeah, but you're you're hugging the mic. So what can I do? That's what she said. I have to sit here like a quiet Nigerian woman and just wait for you to yeah, finish I got asking you. ten thousand questions. I got you. I talk about Miami ten times. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ask a question, man, because we got to round up soon. Go ahead. So my question for you is like, kind of what inspired you to go on your own and do so many? Because you're doing so many different things, I'm doing and how a do you lot, do it? Girl. You know, oh my you're gosh. burning. E- you okay? End. I'm doing a lot. Let's see. Finish school. <laughs> mm-hmm. uh, uh, that was what, a year ago or yeah. so, my second master. So I got an MBA, oh, and then I like, wanted to like enough. really like. <laughs> I know, no. The only reason I did that, I, I was like, because people are like, man, another master's? Mm. No, but I just I come from like a, a social work psychology. Yeah. That was what my first like background was in, and then okay, and then um, I wanted to get the business side, so I went and got an MBA, wow. and so then after that, that's when I kind of just got into this whole thing that I'm doing now, mm. and I've been doing. I've been a spokesmodel though for about 10 years so yeah. I've been presenting for like years but really kind of branching off into like my own web series and then now the book and yeah. it's just been great so for the past couple of years I've been doing that so and I, I'm passionate my passion is like other people's passion and purpose I love that I like to draw that out so that's kind of where this book came yeah. from so hopefully 
you know, people out there, so for that young professional that's just not sure, you know, you just graduated and you got moved to a big city, not sure what you want to do, or that working mom that might feel like she's in a rut and, you know, her dreams might have faded away. Well, not necessarily. You know, I'm always of the mindset of God created us for a purpose, nice. for a purpose, and yeah. we need to make sure that we fulfill that. So mm. that's why, you know, it's about strategies on how to take action and stay empowered because you always want to live with purpose that's and live to aspire. I'm inspired by yeah. you. Yeah. 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 Let's <laughs> give a round of applause. I uh, thought I was asking questions. So you going to cut me off? Oh, no, no, no. Sorry, I thought you were done. Oh, no, no. But no, we just have to round up, though. Oh, I so I just have one question for you. For Go somebody ahead. who's, like you said, young and budding and trying to build their brand or build their thing, what are some of the kind of like maybe two or three, two or three tips to help them move that process along? Because, you know, I guess everybody can achieve their dreams, but how do you kind of like get to that next step? Get mm. to that next step. So it's really like the book kind of goes yes. to like a fluid process of like, you know, thinking about it, vision boards and things like that. Because some people, I was talking to a friend of mine, she's like, oh, I never even thought about that. And I'm a visionary. Yeah. So I like to see things and yeah. just like envision it. And like I always say, thoughts become things. So you have right. to kind of like make sure that you're even in that mindset. So put it out, put it somewhere. And, you know, really start to kind of stir up that gift of yeah. inside in order to start pursuing what you need to do. Yeah. So that's just kind of a tidbit of what you guys can find. It's so really good. Get that book. Get, get that book. The wow. purpose factor. Book. The purpose factor. Wow. Purpose factor. That yes. is uh, huge. I'm. I. I feel like I have yeah. purpose just in those last few minutes. <laughs> you do really. Yeah, Talk to the um, universe. Yeah. Talk to. <laughs> yeah. Put it out there. Put I just it said. Out there. Thoughts What's become that? things. Oh, do not tap desk. You know. <laughs> can I tap something else? Anyway. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Really? Nick, shut up, man. Really? Is you, oh, my gosh. But hey, you know what, though? Where are your minds? I just said, can I tap something else? I didn't say what I wanted to Where's tap. Where's your mind? My mind is right here. I'll tap it. <laughs> you know, you're not coming back. That once a month contract is canceled. I can't come back. No. Oh, no. I, I like her. <laughs> she's great. She's a sweet right, person. She's, uh, she's fantastic. Nice so, Bukhara, please uh, make sure you come back. And you know what? One thing I like uh, about Bookie, honestly, she's so humble and down to earth. I know nice. chick that look, they don't even look half as good as you, and their attitude stinks to high hey. heaven, and that's why they're single and have no man. Anyway, oh my god! Uh, about oh having my a man. gosh! Hmm? So the life, a whole woman's purpose is to have a man. Like One of them is. Oh, they really? Front, they confront like they don't want it, but trust me, they do want to have a man. I think a man's man. purpose is to have a woman. So why does it have to be? You make it seem like it should be our purpose. That's another conversation. <laughs> that's we'll another talk, conversation. That's a whole man. another talk. What's happened? Yeah. You have to come back so for that. So you in a relationship or what? What's up? Um, and now that was a wonderful segment. Yeah. And thank you. So we got, Thank we got, you so we much for yeah. joining. We gonna talk off air, <laughs> fellas. So much. I try. Let's give a round of applause, to, uh, model entrepreneur. Thank TV you so host. much, everybody. Uh, and all that, Thank man. you so much. We of always course, show man. love. Yeah, we, come on, that. man. We family and everything. Yes, we are family. Just a minute. Let's make sure I get to that car show. Right? <laughs> oh yeah. Oh no, for sure. You want to come to the car show? Yeah, everyone in New York City. Yeah, uh, right now on. it's for the media, but uh, it goes yeah. open to the public Friday, and I'll be here for two weeks. We'll exactly. all be here. It's open minutes. to us right now. The media. The y'all, media. Y'all got to wait till people. Friday. The important people. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. We're yeah. live with the Humble Press, and when we come back, we're going to be joined by Fuji King himself. Yeah. Quam One. Hey, maybe she could join us for First Fridays if you have time. If you're oh, not yeah. too busy. Yeah, maybe. We have First Fridays of the Chambre yeah. from 8, no, from 6 to um, 10 o'clock. It's a like, yeah. social networking and it's 80 themed. Yeah. So we're going to have music. Oh. Olu's going to be on posting. Yes. yes. Oh, okay. And it's free. Check you it come out. through. Yeah. Nice. He'll pick you up. You pick me up? Yeah. I'm taking the train. Oh, now you're taking the train. Now you want to be in the train. Anyway, <laughs> no, I like the train. Yeah, we're coming back with Quan One and Honey Bee. Stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Mm -hmm.